What's going on guys, Casual Savage here, and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to add your live subscribe account to your videos using OBS. Now it's really really simple to do, you will need to head over to your browser for this, and I will be putting a link in the description to what you need. So here we are on OBS, now the first thing you want to do is head over to the sources tab, and you want to select the plus button, and from here you want to select browser. From here you can call this a sub count. Just select OK. Then we need to head over to your browser and a link to this website will be in the description. So this is the website we're going to be using and I've just used PewDiePie as an example. So then we know the sub counter will work because his subs are literally always changing. But to add your own, just head over to the bottom left and you'll simply just type in your channel name. So for example, I'll just type in mine, select enter. As you can see, it will change just like that. Anyway, the point of us being on this site is to get this URL. So once you've searched your channel, right click and select copy on the URL and you can close out of it. Now where it says URL here, you can just press control V to paste that in and select OK. Now this is what we're currently going to get. Now the good thing about this website, you can see the background gets removed straight away. So that's a plus side. The next thing we need to crop it out. For example, we don't need the name, we don't need this stuff at the bottom. So where the sub count is that we created, right click it and select filters. Then at the bottom left, select the plus button, select crop slash pad, select OK. And now this is where you need to do a bit of guesswork because um, OBS don't make it easy on the crop side. So I'm going to put, for example, 235, which is from the top. That works pretty good. I'll also do 235 from the bottom and that has worked out pretty well and I'll do 35 for the sides and that's what we get. So I'm going to set close and believe it or not that's done. So this is now on OBS and we can just say for example set it down there and as you can see that is now going to stay wherever we put it. So we can put it over here for example and that is going to stay there. Now I am also recording with OBS on my other monitor so what I'm going to do is duplicate this so that onto the actual one I'm recording with so then you can see it does come up as you record as well. Okay so you can see this is the OBS I'm recording with and let's just do the same thing again so filters and we're going to crop out what we don't need. So I believe we can do 45 from the top and or for the left and the right and then it's 235 from the left and 235 from the bottom. Select close and that is now done. Now bear in mind it's actually recording this monitor here so this is the main monitor and notice that the sub count is staying right there. Now wherever we put it it's going to stay and it's going to constantly move at the same time. So you can see you can't actually click it from here on this monitor. To move it around you actually have to go on OBS and put it in position. So if you do have an overlay, it will be very useful for this specific part. So then you can make the uh, text actually stand out. But that's it. That is how simple it is to add a live sub count to your live streams or even your recordings using OBS.